about 2000 years ago when king herod ruled judea now a part of israel in nazareth there was a young girl named mary mary was promised to marry a man named joseph who lived there too one day an angel gabriel sent from god came and talked to mary peace be with you god has blessed you dear angel i don't know what you mean mary you're going to have a baby that will be god's own son and his kingdom will never end i believe and trust in god i am the servant girl of the lord let it happen how god chooses and the angel left now joseph was in shock what to do when he heard that mary was going to have a baby one day while he was asleep the angel came to talk to joseph too joseph mary is going to have a baby from god it's okay for you to marry her and take care of her baby you will name the baby jesus which means savior because he will save the people from their sins the angel in my dream must be sent from god i should believe him and not fear anymore i will do as the angel has guided me and that's just what he did mary and joseph lived in the part of the roman empire and the emperor was caesar augustus while later king herod who ruled judea said that everyone had to go to their own hometown to be counted everyone go to your own hometown i want to count you i want to make sure everyone is paying their taxes so mary and joseph went to the town of bethlehem from nazareth to be counted because Joseph was of the home and line of David and Bethlehem was known as the city of David there were lots of other people there too there were so many people in fact that there was no room for them in the inn mary there is no place for us many people have registered their names in the census yes and every house is full and every bed is taken all of the ends we have to stay in that stable over there even though it is full of animals it doesn't matter we do god's will so mary and joseph stayed in a stable which was a place for animals to stay warm and dry there was a cow there there was a sheep there there was a chicken there and mary and joseph stayed there too While they were there baby Jesus was born Mary took him and wrapped him up warm and laid him in the manger That night there were some shepherds out in the fields watching over their flocks of sheep It is getting late let's feed the sheep Look over there who is that Don't be afraid I bring you good news The savior the Christ has been born today in Bethlehem. You will get the baby wrapped in a soft cloth and laid in a manger. Oh angel, you bring such good news. Glory to God. Glory to God. And when the angel left, the shepherd went and found the baby Jesus in the manger. as they were being told and when they found him they worshiped him the baby is lying in the manger just like the angel said we need to tell everybody that god has sent his son to us little three kings gaspar Balthazar and Melchior, who were wise men from the east, saw the bright star. Do you see the bright star? 
bright star? Yes, I do guess, but we all know what that means. Yes, the old writings that we have read say that when Jesus is born, a bright star will appear in the sky. What are we waiting for? The wise men followed the star towards the country of Judea and when they got to the capital, Jerusalem, they began to ask people, Where is the child who is born to the king of the Jews? We come from each to worship him. Where is he? Who is born? King of Jews! Yes, we all eager to meet him. Herod, the evil king of Judea, heard this and sent for the wise men to come to him. Where is the king of Jews to be born? Go and find him and let me know where he is so I can go and worship him too. But King Herod didn't really want to worship baby Jesus. He wanted to harm him. So the wise men were already warned about this by the God. Flash to meet the divine king. Who will be our protector one day? We should tell this to the king, Herod. But he is evil. He might want to harm the baby. We need to protect him. Yes, so let us go home another way, so that we do not have to meet the king. When the king found out he was straight, he was really mad. Ah! I am really angry! The three men have tricked me! He was determined to destroy this newborn king. So King Herod sent his soldiers to Bethlehem to find the baby Jesus. But God warned Joseph in a dream to get out of there. Joseph, Jesus can be in danger. The evil king Herod wants to harm him. Please leave the stable and take your family to a safe place. And so, Joseph and Mary and the little baby Jesus went to Egypt. And they stayed there until the evil king Herod died. Joseph, Mary, you can come back now. It's safe to come back to Nazareth. Mary and Joseph and baby Jesus came back from Egypt and started to live in the town of Nazareth in Israel again. That's where baby Jesus grew up until he was grown.
and so now you have heard it all about how god sent his only son to be born as a baby so that later he could save everyone from their sins and all it took was just a little christmas glory to god in the highest peace on earth mary's boy till jesus christ was born on christmas day and man will live forever because of christmas day